Integrating your Interact quiz with your HubSpot account means that when someone subscribes to your quiz, their information will be passed right over to HubSpot where you can email them and stay in touch. Let me show you how to set that up. In your Interact account, open the quiz that you're looking to integrate. Over on the left menu, turn on Lead Generation. The first thing you'll do is set up your opt-in form. So you can select certain contact fields that you want to collect here. There are different form settings that you can play around with, like making the opt-in form optional or required. Once you have it set up to your liking, go ahead and click Save and Continue. From this page, you'll choose HubSpot as the direct integration. And you will be prompted here to add in your HubSpot credentials so it knows where your HubSpot account is. Once you get onto this page, you are able to set up specific triggers or actions rather that tell you which result your quiz lead got. So I'll click on add action. And from here, you can choose to add someone to a HubSpot contact list, workflow or contact property. Here at Interact, we also use HubSpot, and in my experience, I found it easiest to update a contact property that tells you which quiz result your quiz taker got. This way, you can create lists in your HubSpot account based on that contact property field, or even set up triggers for your workflows based on the property field as well. So let's first set up that contact property field in your HubSpot account. To do so, choose the settings icon, under data management, select properties, and here you can create a new property. Choose which object you would like to attach the property to, which group it should go with. For example, I like to put it on the contact object, contact information, and then you can label the property field something like quiz results. Hit next. Select field type as single line of text, click next, and then hit create. Now let's head back over to Interact and complete the integration. Click on Add Action, and then from the Update Contact Property field, choose the field that you've just created, Quiz Results. Leave this value blank, or you can change it. This is the single line of text that will appear in your Interact account that tells you which result this person got. Make sure whatever value you're adding here, you know which quiz result this relates to, so you can send them the proper information or follow-ups that you might be emailing them. Click Save. You can apply, if you didn't change the value, you can click apply to all results and then hit confirm. You know that these are set up when you see these pink lightning bolts appear. You can see if I click on result number two, the value changes to the exact name of the quiz result here. And same thing for my third result. Once this looks good, click save and continue. You can do the same thing based on any answers people are choosing in your quiz as well. Again, hit add action, create a contact property that would update with the value of the answer they chose and then click save. I'm gonna skip this step, I'll hit save and continue. And here's where you wanna make sure the mapping is correct. So the email address that they're putting into the Interact opt-in form matches the email field of HubSpot. And same thing for the first name and any other information that you're collecting on your quiz opt-in form. This looks good, hit save and continue, and then you are able to test the integration. The test shows that it was successful. Let's head over to HubSpot and make sure the contact came through. Here I am on the contact page in HubSpot. If you click on Actions, View All Properties, and then search for Quiz Results, you can see here's the result that I got from this quiz. The last step is to simply publish your quiz. Click on Publish, Publish Changes, and here is your quiz link and embed codes to add the quiz to your website or even as an announcement bar or a pop-up. And that is how you can integrate your Interact quiz with your HubSpot account, allowing you to email very specific messages to your quiz takers based on the results or answers that they're choosing from your quiz.